everyone, so I'm back. I finished my dopey two weeks ago. Um, I just gonna make, I just want to do this video, of course, as I said, talking about the experience. Just uh, getting out of the way first. It was completely exhausting, as I thought it would be. Doing like full, a full Disney vacation plus. Getting up at 2.30 every day to, to run races um, and I ended up, ended up super sick I'm still not completely well even though it's been two weeks It was also a great experience um, Overall, there were some moments that now I know I could have fixed but I didn't know then It was hard um, Nothing went according to plan, but overall, where it was a, like a great, great experience. Okay, so let's begin. Well, as you can see, first I'll make a video about this someday. Uh, but finally, I have all of my medals. All the medals have earned. Finally, for the first time, all together, you can see. All the do the dopey the three dopies, goofies, marathons, 5Ks, 10Ks, everything together, and that's great. <laughs> finally, finally, it's been years. Uh, some medals like I ran the races like a year and a half ago, and I didn't have them. And you can see all of the medals right there. So, 5K, first day. Waking up at 2.30, which ended up being my regular waking up day. My plan was to go a little harder at the beginning, so I didn't have to do any lines for the characters. Well, that went well, because I didn't have any lines. Um, but I went too hard. I had a, a personal best of 20 minutes with zero seconds, which I'm very happy about, I'm very proud about, but um, I shouldn't have gone that, that, that hard because I was tired from the first day. Like my legs already started um, hurting. But yeah, I think I ended up being like on like 25th place overall on that race. And I didn't even go as, as fast as I could and I stopped for two characters. I'll put some pictures while I talk, so you can see it. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, so the kind of went well, but it was like too hard for me to go that, that fast. Then the next day, 10K, exactly as planned. My time was 48 minutes or and something. I stopped for some characters. It went, it went very well, very well. But then the issue started. Because I had, you have two. Um, oh my God, I just, I just can't believe I didn't like look more into it. But you have two bibs for the dopey. I w one for the 5k and the 10k, which is this one. I one for the half and the full, which is like the colors are converted. But I had a different. Uh, <clears throat> I get kind of mad thinking about it because I should have known better. You have different corals. So um, I had the A coral for the first two races, which was why I could do them really well. But I had the F coral for the half and the full, which is the last coral. I didn't know it was the last one. Um, and even after I knew that, I didn't think it was gonna be that bad, but it was pretty bad. Um, you start the races almost an hour later, uh, and there's so, mon so many people just like, crawling away, just going so slow, clogging up the whole road. It was a pretty bad experience for the for the beginning of the of the half marathon. It was a pretty bad beginning for the half marathon. It was really bad. Until I got to Magic Kingdom. And it, it went better after that. It went actually well after that. But I still had to do like long lines for pictures, everything that I didn't want to do. You know and I was like well okay it was not that bad. It was, but but yeah, but that was so. Yeah. That was my slowest back, back, half marathon back, 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 back. ever. 
I was even thinking about personal best, but I had the slowest one. Because I had to go um, to make like a three minute line here, a two, three, five minute line there. Not that at, at top, so probably it was like five to ten minutes um, that I, I, I would have saved. I even at the end I was I had to go to the restroom for the first time during a race. Uh, I could have done it afterwards, but I was like, whatever. And it was like another five minutes doing that. So I ended up in a 206. It was just like I was really mad and frustrated, but I just like let it go and got like ready for the next day. I didn't know what to do. Um, then the next day I was again in the F Coral. And I wanted to go to skip to another corral. It was really hard, but they were checking. But I saw my chance when they started uh, walking, and I, I, I was able to skip to leave my corral and get into the D corral, which is not the best, but it was pretty good. Pretty like my experience in the full marathon was way better, but still not what I what I have planned, what I have thought about. I run well, but all of the races, but because of the lines. I did like a five minute line to have a picture to get a picture with Dopey. I had like a three minute line to get a picture with Beast. Um, that was mostly it. Um, yeah. That's eight minutes of my time. So I had my slowest marathon ever. 406. Um, 406. But I run it. I run it well. I did. I wasn't after being in the fourth race in a row. I was not uh, sore at all. And since we got into Epcot, which is like the last three kilometers, I flew. I was running at like at 420 something for the last three kilometers, and I was feeling great. You now it was a shame that I had to go through me that many people, and I had to make lines for the pictures and waste so much time. But it was like overall a great experience uh, now I know I think I, I could have complained since the beginning at the expo uh, the expo went well by the way uh, because I had like an I had like a proof of time an A, an a, cor, an a beef and an F beef that doesn't make sense um, also I read later like many days later that some people got their maybe like your your they you lose your beef or it gets uh, ripped or whatever and they would let them use a different, like your, your 5k and 10k beef for your half and full marathon because it turns out it's the same tracker so that means I could have just gone in there because I thought about it but I, I didn't see anyone using this beef for the other races you have just gone with it and got it, gotten into the A corral so there are like a couple of things I could have done uh, plus jumping corrals my experience would have been way better honestly but it didn't happen you know um, it was very good overall it was it was really a challenge this time because so uh, I, I would I would get up much later I remember, I remember on my my last dopey also the races started 530 now they start at 5 um, but you know um, it was very good I didn't add up all the times, we can kind of do it right now. Okay, I, I, I added it up right now, I think it was like 7 hours and 8 minutes, more or less, overall. My last, the dopey that I run here, that is very different, was um, 6.39 I believe. We'll compare it right here, but I think, not seeing, not seeing it right now, I think this was my, my slowest dopey overall. Even though I trained the best I had ever trained, whatever. But you can take like more than 10 minutes of the time just by making lines that I didn't have to do last time, like in the in-person dopey, or like of course in the virtual dopey. So yeah, you know when you finish, they gave me this, they gave me my medals. I have all my pictures as you've been seeing in the in the. Yeah in the video um, no awesome awesome experience right now I don't think I will ever do it again 
Maybe it's so hard to get in, so stressful, so expensive. Um, and I think I'm ready for like other challenges, like real races where I don't have to worry about people walking the race or taking pictures or whatever, just really just racing. Um, yeah, I mean, after I finish my Mexico City marathons, I have marathons in two years. Yeah, I will only be looking at fast races other than the majors, you know, um, to get really, really fast times. Like most people do, but yeah, it was great, great experience. You know, after more than two years, three years waiting for it, uh, planning it, hoping, hoping that it would happen. It happened and it was a success, I would say, even though it could have been better, even though I could have done things to make it better, but yeah, uh, that was the Dopey Challenge 2023. I do plan to, have I do want to do more run Disney stuff I want to do like the coast to coast and the castle to chateau whenever that exists again uh, but again it's just so difficult to do it to like get in uh, so stressful and so expensive everything is so stressful I hope it happens in uh, maybe five years that's it for now so don't forget to like subscribe and run